the hallowed grounds of UA. The school with the best hero Superhero Harvard. in the world. The place every kid wants to go. Imagine being a kid and caring about school. <laughs> is that a cultural thing? The school's alumni list is a who's who of idols. All Might. Well, I'm sold. You had me at All Might. The fiery hero, Endeavor. Endeavor. Hmm. Not to mention the denim-clad award-winning Marvel, Best Genist. What? What is his power? This was it. The first step towards achieving my dream of becoming a pro. Time for introduction over analysis. <laughs> it was only after I left school that I appreciated it. Actually, I think I caught the tail end of it. College. College was decent. Because I finally realized that it was something that I should be taking from greedily. It wasn't something that I had to do. Something switched in my brain where it wasn't about me proving something to the teachers, but me taking what I needed from them and taking what I needed from the institutions. And a lot of times that wasn't what they were trying to give me, you know? It was about like asking questions towards my interests, choosing the assignments I wanted to do, being all right with, you know, getting lower grades and losing points for attendance and dumbass homework assignments and things like that. But it made me appreciate education. And in fact, there's a very good chance I'm going to be a student <laughs> in the near future because when or if I go to Korea, I don't want to work there as a teacher again. So I'm planning on doing the language program because that gives me a, a student visa. Honestly, I'm pumped. It's so much fun being an adult in the classroom. It's also fun being a student after you've been a teacher. Like I was a teacher for six or seven years. So very excited. I love school. I love first days and I used to hate it. I was the worst student ever in the world. This is nuts. Damn, they have mini cities. Yeah, wow. Build this? <laughs> it's a big business, big industry, superhero. It's a real racket. There are three types of faux villains in every battle center. You'll learn points based on their Yeah, and there's also the one that doesn't cost any points, score any points. There's probably a catch. How come none of these guys seem nervous at all? Are they that confident? I feel like this kind of industry attracts the egotistical type for some reason. It's her, the nice girl I met at the school gates. Nice girl, huh? <laughs> this guy. The barrel Looks laughs. Like she's trying to focus on the trials ahead. What are you going to do? Distract her and ruin her This is to this succeed. guy is such a busybody. <gasps> I'm already behind. Crap. Hey, wait up, fix the bills for me. Episode 4, Starline. <laughs> I'll catch up to them. After all, I've got all my power in me. Yeah, I moved all that trash that prepared me for anything. You swallowed it. Yes. <laughs> oh no, stop. I don't feel like anything's different yet. It should kick in after two, maybe three hours. It's cutting it close. You haven't even taken it for a test drive yet. The physical backlash of one for all can be intense. Huh? You should have done this yesterday. Real talk. You've got to prepare yourself before using this quirk. So I want you to clench your butt cheeks and yell this <laughs> from the depths of your heart. Ugh, this is getting weird. That's some great dodging. Top tier. Did he just shoot a laser beam out of his crotch? Oh, okay. It's a little bit better. <laughs> Merci Boku. <laughs> I couldn't understand the language he was speaking. Did she do that? It's pretty amazing. Yeah, I mean, of course it wasn't going to be easy. You haven't even started to use your powers yet. The most successful students use a combination of all these tactics. They're the ones who rack up the highest scores. Hmm. Are they selling their data? The economy. <laughs> Who's paying for this? Is this government subsidized? Are these kids taking out exorbitant student loans? Am I crazy or is this whole industry a tremendous drain? Or can they afford to build these training mini cities by selling users personal data, Facebook style? All this money, all these resources going into an industry that's sole purpose is preventing economic destruction. That's a black hole. Nothing is gained or created. It's, it's a loss. It's a major loss for society. This is a bubble that will burst. Economic collapse and recession. I'd say this year's group looks promising. Well, there's still plenty of time before it's over. There's something shady going on, isn't there? This is not just a school. Think of it as a hurdle you should try to avoid. I recommend my listeners try to ignore it and focus on the ones top of the charts. <laughs> they were all the same size on the screen. Use your book. Page 129. A person's true character is revealed when they're faced with danger. Even in this moment of crisis, can't mind his own business. <laughs> two minutes remaining. You gotta pull something out of you. Everything all my did for me, all that training. 
All that trash. Plot twist, All Might didn't care about Deku at all. He just really hates pollution. He just thought it would be funny to make Deku eat hair. <laughs> at least the beach is clean. Yeah, actually this is really dangerous now that I think about it. How many people die? Time to secure a date. I mean, repay the favor. Maybe this is the real test. Oh, well there you go. First power use. So clench your butt cheeks. <laughs> the butt cheeks thing again. Nice. Nothing is nobler than self sacrifice. Self sacrifice, huh? Just one minute left. It's alright, you already won. I'm broken. Did you remember to clench your butt cheeks? Detroit smash! <laughs> it's the only chance I've got to survive. My legs and my right arm are broken. So just one option. This is a long fall. <laughs> it's time for a whole monologue. Someone can catch him too. Yeah, there you go. Did she just puke rainbows? <laughs> Rainbow sparkles? Interesting quirk. Yeah, but Deku just got fast tracked because of what he did. Did you see that dude's attack? I didn't think he had that kind of strength. There you go. Forced to respect it. There's no way he's passing with a zero score like that. True, but you gotta admit that was a pretty amazing move. Set him straight, busybody. They're all missing the point. <laughs> Don't they see what he did? The one time he keeps his mouth shut. If this hadn't been an exam, then of course I would have done the same. Ah, uh, he has doubts. How do you know? The exam. The judges. They saw that. That was the exam. Your heroes in my eyes, every one of you. This voice sounds familiar too. Everyone's voice sounds familiar. Give me some sugar. You're watching a school nurse in action. The youthful heroine. Recovery girl. Youthful heroine, huh? Look, she's saving him months of recovery time. It's actually a really cool power. What if the exam has other parameters I didn't take into account? It's possible. Forget the exam, man. That's not the lesson here. The lesson is you you had the wrong priority. In a world of heroes, true heroes are rare. The great irony of the show. Everyone's so vapid. Test scores this and brand deals that. Look at my big ass, look at my big ass, etc. Everyone knows the value of their careers, but so few people know the value of a human life. What the world needs isn't more heroes, but more virtue, more kindness, and maybe sacrifice, like that guy said. Based on my own estimates. He's still working. I barely passed the written part of the exam, and ever since the exam. I haven't been able to get in touch with All Might. That's weird. What's up with him? Is he on a bender? No matter what, I just want you to know I'm proud of you and I think you're really cool, sweetie. <laughs> a mother's love always cheers up a teen boy. That's all you really need. Besides, he trusted me. So I'll keep my mouth shut. Seems wise, having some discretion. You saw potential in me, but I failed. I feel like I should be working out while watching the show. But I'll keep trying. Just be patient. Your test results from UA. Booyah, I am here as a projector now. <laughs> Best intro. But this is from UA, isn't it? You can't hear you, it's a projection. Huh? Yes, what's the matter? Who's showboating? Oh, sorry, I'll wrap it up, but I have to show him something first. <laughs> Who's showboating? Oh, I have to do how many of these things? <laughs> Make that money. Make that paycheck, All Might. I'm a failure. Chill. Just be patient. A short clip for your viewing pleasure. Um, do you have a sec? Sorry to interrupt. It's that nice girl. Nice, huh? What does she have to say? You'll have to stay tuned to find out. How did this turn into a TV show with a commercial break? He's kind of plain looking. Uh, it doesn't really stand out or anything, you know? She means me. <laughs> How did he know? <laughs> That's so sad. How could someone who took down that huge villain all by himself not have any points in the end? Don't worry, they're already accounting for that. I have to make it up to him. It's a good thing they were recording for this. They just had those cameras ready. But there's no reason to give him your points. The kid's charting well on his own. Yeah, yeah. Of course. 
How could a hero course reject someone who is committed to saving others, no matter the consequences you would hope. himself? It's a good thing they haven't been totally taken over by corporate profits yet. Psychic Girl seems nice, though. It was nice of her to actually think of him like that. I think a lot of people might have taken that for granted. I mean, he did save her life, so it's kind of a big deal. So we have rescue points! <laughs> this is so Harry Potter. It's like, they lose, but they get Gryffindor points. I don't tackle Uraraka! 45 rescue points! Right, she rescued him, too. You have made it. You're now part of the hero academia. And now, I'm enrolling in the high school of my dreams. My hero academia. <laughs> Why is it touching? I think partly it's the music. The music is really good. There's nothing really complex about it, right? About these moments, but they're still kind of moving. You know, the relief of being acknowledged, goodness being rewarded, hard work paying off, gratitude for one's gifts or one's good experiences. The episodes keep ending on a strong note like that. They keep ending in ways that are subtly kind of moving, kind of touching. I think it feels good when you witness goodness working in the way you want it to work. Because it doesn't always, and sometimes it seems like it doesn't at all, right? Like you do good deeds and then maybe they go unrewarded, or they seem to go unrewarded, even though the, the rewards, in my opinion, if aligned correctly, are, are intrinsic to the act itself. But there's goodness in the world. You know, all my jokes about like corporate structures and selling data and everything and the economy collapsing, which is an inevitability. Aside, there are a lot of examples of real sweetness like all might is just you know he's a gem <laughs> the girl psychic girl is really cool she seems sweet it was nice of her to go back for deku deku is you know he is he's heroic in his actions to save others and just thinking about the real world deku in real life would have a lot of other stuff mixed in too like it wouldn't all be wholesome and self-sacrificial there would also probably be a desire to be liked in there somewhere a desire for status or something like that but at least there is the good stuff too like he puts his money where his mouth is he has skin in the game He's not all talk. He's not only looking for attention. He is doing great things. And so for him to get rewarded for that, it's nice. I've heard some negative things about him as a protagonist. I think he's not well received, but I don't know. At this point, I want him to succeed. I think a good way to look at it and why this is satisfying, at least to me, is to look at it in reverse. I think it's a major tragedy when somebody exhibits great things like kindness or selflessness or honor or, or whatever and is punished for that. That hurts because what they are, the greatness that they have is so rare. And to watch somebody question that about themselves is a loss for the world, in my opinion. You hate to see good people get hurt. It's the most tragic thing. Sometimes I think the worst thing you could do is hurt the innocent, you know, or like do something to destroy goodness out of your own bitterness or whatever. And so here it feels good because it's rewarded. Like the goodness is rewarded. It's acknowledged. It's, it's prioritized and valued. So yeah, I mean, it was sort of obvious that he was going to pass the exam because of that, but whatever. It led to a cool speech. It led to a touching moment with some, some good music and it led to a pretty funny hologram scene with with all might i would probably buy the merch not gonna lie so yeah that's it for episode four see you guys next time when we maybe start classes